Hello there, welcome to Manifesting the Miraculous. This is Aurelia from Aurelia's Light, and I'm so happy to have you here. Tonight we're going to be doing a short meditation from the Book of Psalms, and we're going to particularly focus on Psalm 23. Now a psalm is a poem or a song used to worship the divine. The word psalm comes from the Greek word salmos, which means a song sung to harp music. Originally, the salmos was used and supported by a harp instrument, but in that time period, it wasn't a harp, it was the lyre or the lyra. And David is the author of many of the biblical psalms, and he's also known as the one who played the harp. Just a little background about this particular psalm before we get into the meditation. So this Psalm 23 could be also known as the protective psalm. That's why it's such a beautiful psalm to go to sleep with and to meditate with. Now this psalm again was written by David, either when he was in distressed circumstances or being persecuted by Saul. And he was in the forest of Hareth, which he used these words to comfort himself with the Lord being his shepherd, so that he should not want, nor would he fear, was he in the worse circumstances than he at present was, or rather, when he was settled upon the throne of Israel, and in the most prosperous and flourishing state of reign. As the latter part of this psalm shows, he speaks not only in his own person, but in the name of all believers. For Christ, who is the shepherd spoken of, is a common shepherd to all the saints. Now, whatever you believe to be the source of all things, if you'd like, you can substitute the word Lord for Elohim, Jehovah, God, source, uh, the force. So it is up to you to use whatever you feel comfortable with. Now, in this meditation, I would invite you to be in your bed, uh, laying down and ready for the night so that this beautiful psalm can carry you into your sleep and into your subconscious mind. Because psalms are really like beautiful magic spells or subconscious mind retraining program to put you in alignment with the source and to put you in alignment with the strength and the connection that you already possess with source energy. Now let's start this meditation by relaxing our body, laying down and noticing the bed underneath our body that's supporting us. and allowing our hands to fall softly on our side and our legs to be uncrossed. And let's bring our awareness to our breath. Gently expanding the belly and relaxing. Now let's deepen the breath. And start to allow everything to dissolve. And you become one with your breath. And if you notice an area of your body that has any resistance, just bring your awareness to it and breathe into that space and tell it to relax. Now my voice and the sounds that you hear are just going to enable you to relax even further. Surrendering into your breath, expanding your consciousness, and the connection between all the energy bodies. Deep 
deeper and deeper you relax and the more you let go. And let's bring our awareness to high above our head. Imagine a beautiful warm energy. Golden light is coming down towards your head, towards the crown. And the crown opens up to receive this beautiful energy. As it touches the top of your head, it brings a warm, soothing energy, comfort, nourishment, protection, love. This energy helps to nourish your cells, balance your organs, and deepens your relaxation. Feel the energy moving around the left side of your head and the right side of your head. And down your face, relaxing your jaw. Down your neck, the front of your neck and the back of your neck. On your shoulders. You feel your shoulders just let go. The energy moves down your arms, out your fingertips. Down your chest. And it circles your heart. You can feel your heart opening, drinking in this energy, drinking in the love, drinking in the divine. The energy moves down your torso, your abdomen, the lower abdomen. And you breathe into this. And you notice how relaxed you're getting. How deeply you're surrendering. And the energy moves down your hips, your thighs. Your knees and your shins. You see this energy moving from the tips of your toes all the way back up to your crown and back down again. You are filled with this beautiful nourishing energy, this healing divine energy. And with a deep breath in, you expand this energy outward. And you notice how deeply relaxed you are. And how deeply surrendered you are. And you are fully in this present moment. My voice relaxes you. You trust me. You trust yourself. And you trust the process. Your mind and your heart are open to receive these beautiful songs 
as they carry you into sleep. I'm going to count backwards from 10 to 1. And with every number, you get deeper and deeper into a relaxed, serene, peaceful state. 10, 9, 8. Seven, six, five, four, deeper and deeper, three, more relaxed, two, one. The Lord is my shepherd. I lack nothing. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside quiet waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the right paths for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will fear no evil, for you are with me, your rod and your staff. They comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, and my cup overflows. Surely your goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. The Lord is my shepherd. I lack nothing. The Lord is my shepherd. I lack nothing. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside quiet waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the right paths for his name's sake. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside quiet waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the right paths for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will fear no evil. For you are with me your rod and your staff, and they comfort me. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will fear no evil. For you are with me, your rod and your staff, and they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows.
surely your goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Surely your goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Is my shepherd. I lack nothing. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside quiet waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the right paths for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will fear no evil, for you are with me, your rod and your staff. They comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, and my cup overflows. Surely your goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. my shepherd. I lack nothing. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside quiet waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the right paths for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will fear no evil, for you are with me, your rod and your staff. They comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, and my cup overflows. Surely your goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. The Lord is my shepherd. I lack nothing. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside quiet waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the right paths for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will fear no evil, for you are with me, your rod and your staff. They comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. 
You anoint my head with oil, and my cup overflows. Surely your goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. my shepherd. I lack nothing. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside quiet waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the right paths for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I will fear no evil, for you are with me, your rod and your staff. They comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, and my cup overflows. Surely your goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Surely your goodness and love will follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. of the Lord. 